everybody, it's Deb from d, d Art Gallery. Hope you're doing well today. I have a 16 by 20 inch canvas here that I'm going to do multiple dirty pours on. And I've already poured one of the cups, but I wanted to go over my paints first. Um, the first paint is the Handmade Modern um, Shimmer Egg. Very, very pretty color. And I am using the DecoArt Metallic Rose Gold. And I may, I'm using a yellow color I made up. And I think that's it. The rest of my colors are um, colors that I made up from a video that Julie Cutts did a long time ago. And it was for her blues and her greens. And I really just love these colors and I think it's worth going through. So let me show you the first one. It's called Coastal Turquoise. Very pretty. This second one is called Deep Sea. Using a lot of shades of the blue today. Deep Sea. The third one is the Navy Blue. The fourth one is called uh, Lime Green. Very nice color. This one is called Peacock. The next one is Dioxazine Purple. The next one is called Southern Seas. Very, very pretty light blue. And the last one is called Marina. And let me show you the consistency with the marina. Just leaves a little, a little trace. Again, I mixed these from a video Julie Cuts of Pouring Your Heart Out did. And if you ever get a chance to find that video of hers, it is worth it. I think the colors are just fantastic. Pouring medium today is two parts Floetrol to one part paint. Score to GAC 800 was used in all the paints. And I did have to um, thin them with my mixture of 90% water, 10% Floetrol. As you can see, I've put down a light, coat, a light coat of the Artist Law Flow Acrylic White to help the paints move. And I have, I did do my first big cup of paint just to save a little time. And I think I'm going to do two small cups. So I will just um, finish doing that. I wanted to show you the consistency in these paint colors, how pretty they are. No particular order. And I do hope that this rose gold plays well with the other colors. And I'll show you this 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 shimmer egg up close. It's it's very very pretty, and this is a paint from Target. The Modern Made, it's called. Pretty happy with those paints.
I've used this lime green before and it's it's very pretty with the blues. And my dog is right under my feet again, trying to find a place to lay down here. Okay, I'm going to just move my paints out of the way here. have a little bit of this left I'm gonna use it up it's so 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 pretty okay I did not add any silicone today so let's start with my big cup I'll try and do a ring pour here. I really am liking these silicone cups. So very nice to tandem and to clean. Okay, just gonna do a little tip to bring that more into the middle. And now I'll do my little cup. I'm just gonna pour it right here on the edge of the, the big one. And again, I'm going to pour it down here.
and pour another one here. And here's my other little cup. And I'll put another one here. And let's put one up here. And one in here. Just no rhyme or ry rhythm to it here. Just going with the flow. Let's see what I have left here. Okay. Just going to take my skewer here and help these out a little bit. I wish I could get a little bit better on the middle. But maybe I could help it out a little bit here before I start tipping. Okay, and I'm going to need a torch before I tip. Okay. Let's see what kind of fun we can have with this now. I just saw all those blue paints sitting in a box uh, under my table here and I thought I haven't really worked with those in a long time. And thought why not give them a try. Just kind of trying to go in a circular motion here as much as I can in the beginning. I'm going to bring it back kind of to the middle. And then tip again. And bring it back. Let's see, 
something in here that doesn't belong. I'll take that out right away. Okay, tip down to this corner a little. And bring it back. As you can see, I really do want these to get distorted. And I'm going to go to this corner over here. I do want to keep that rose gold, though, as much as I can. I'm going to let it go over this corner and come back. Just going to take a look at it now, see what's going on. And I see a few more little lumps in here. I want to try and get out. Okay. Let's see. Let's go to this corner down here. First, I'm going to bring it this way. Pardon me for getting you out of camera here for a minute. Okay, bring it over and bring it back. And now I will try for this corner over here. Bring it back. And I'm going to bring it down to go over the side down at the bottom here. Bring it right back again. Just going to bring it down this way a bit. Try and get over this the bottom here. Really trying to save the yellow here. Okay, just going to take another look at it. The reason I stop and look is trying to see where I really like it, where I don't, what I want to save and what I don't mind tipping off. There's something in there. Okay. 
Okay, let's see here. We have one more corner to get over. Okay, I'm going to bring that back and stretch that out. I'm going to take another look at it here. See what I want to do here. I'm just going to stretch this a little more here. And I'll let a little bit of that go off. And come back. Just stretch that out a little bit. And I'm going to let a little bit of this come off this corner down here, too. It's just looking a little plain to me, and I think we can get it to look a little better. I bring it back. And take another look. That's much better. Okay. I think I'm liking that a lot. I'm going to check my sides here. Make sure they're all covered. My corners. And I'll check that side over there when we get down for a close-up. I think I'll torch one more time. This rose gold right in here showed up so very pretty. The, the dioxazine purple in this area, along with that lime green. Here's a little bit more of the purple with the dark blues. Yellow poking through here and there. Very, very happy. The lines are very beautiful. And I'll just clean off the bottom here real quick. And we'll get you down for a close-up. Again, this is a 16 by 20 canvas, multi-ring pour, multi-dirty ring pour, I should say. 
and I'll get a little bit better in focus here for you. There you go. Okay, get you down and you can tell me what you think. We have the upper left hand corner here. Very pretty with the lime. The lime green came through with the blue in that, that shimmer egg color coming through there. Nice lines in here. Here's the yellow that came through so pretty with the blues. Starting to see the, the rose gold here coming through. And in here, very nice. This is the lower left-hand corner. And I'll take you up the middle here. Again, a lot of the lime came, coming through with the dioxazine purple there. The yellow, very light yellow. Real pretty in here. Can really see it shimmering. Here's some more of the rose gold that came through. That's really nice with that lime green line there. This is the upper right hand corner. Some more of the dioxazine purple came through. Nice lines in here too, very pretty. This is the lower right hand corner. So let me know what you think. Give me a thumbs up if you like this video and share it. Subscribe if you haven't. Make sure and ring the bell, choose all, so you'll know the next time that I do post a new video. And until next time, take care everybody. Thank you for watching. Bye.